what up y'all this is an fl studio 20 hi-hat tutorial so we have this starter melody here that we're just rocking with right now and the next step is to add hi-hats so make sure we're in a different pattern make sure that pattern's laid down there probably want this pattern to be at least a four bar and then um there's a lot of different places you can go i think to get a hi-hat if you don't have any drum kits i suggest going to legacy drums vintage and see what we can do here the chai hat is pretty classic um but you know i'm gonna i'm gonna bring you through a method that is really more uh, obvious there's also a lot of hi-hats within the actual synths themselves a lot of synths have hi-hats but uh we're just gonna like That smart, that hi hat, that chai, that one right might work right there. I'm just like, you see, how I just pick them. You could probably have that in there too. And there's a couple ways to record hi hats. You could push it in here. I'm gonna show you my fun method, which is like using a computer keyboard. So make sure this is highlighted. And then for me, the bass note is the comma button. So like, and then I just try to like. And to get it right for me, it's I gotta like maybe hum or whatever over it. So. so we got the yeah. Oh, oh man, that was a big mistake. So when you're recording hi hats, put it to one fourth beat. Make sure it's on the new pattern. All right, so we just totally deleted that one. We're gonna try that again. Terrible, terrible. I'm actually hitting comma M comma. I'm actually going down on that second part. Kind of cold, right? We can keep that whole 16 just for the heck of it. And I didn't go down that time. Probably take. Uh, where did that go wrong? See, little errors there. Uh, that's one way to do a hi hat. And if you want to add like a second layer of hat, we already have that backup one here. This is probably a lot quieter when we're finished recording it, but we're at pattern three, so we're just gonna record. I kind of like accidentally hit my keyboard there and just like uh, you don't have to feel pressure to doing this and as you can see I, I, I didn't do anything crazy there I just kind of like I think it's easier to record that way than to press it in the in the channel rack because I mean how much faster do you want to go like that was literally at the pace of the beat so we'll probably want to turn this down so pattern three we probably want to turn both these down. These are both already in the um, mixer at two and three. So I just right here. That's 
basic hi hats right there. Um, I don't know, like, when you'd want to start this, maybe after this first part. Maybe have this part. I'm not totally in love with the this part. If it does, if it is terrible, you just take it out. I mean, you don't have to have it in there. Sauce it up a little bit. So we're just doing like a little ding ding. We skip one, do 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 bang. So we got that down pretty much. Cool, right? That's it for this video. This is FO Studio 20 basic hi hat tutorial. And if you go into the channel rack, you'll see the hi hats there. This is chat pattern three two, three two, three two, three two, three two, three two, three two. Three, two, three, two. And you know, while we're here, you know, for the heck of it, I'll show the alternate method, which is just like, okay, say we wanna, we have a different hi hat that we like. Uh, what makes sense? We'll, we'll try that uh, chai hat that we saw in the um, in the legacy pack. Legacy drums, vintage, nope, okay. drums, vintage, oh my gosh, drums, vintage, it's like, I can only go so long without something annoying me during the day, I got that mix here, we can we'll put that in there, so, say we want to like, I think that's like every two steps, it's either every two or every four, that pace right there, like, So if it's like, see that's too fast. Yeah, it is four. But see, see how that gets annoying because it won't go through the whole thing, and then it's like literally impossible to tell. Like, like can you eyeball this? I still can't. I've been making beats for years. Like, it's ridiculous. Every four, okay. So we'll do. You gotta like fill that out and then do four. I'm just right clicking, fill each four step. And it'll be like. That could be something that gets added in. But you're putting a lot of pressure on the kick snare right there. Yeah, I'm gonna make another video on the kick snare. So uh, stay tuned for that if you just want to watch the other video. I'm pretty much going to upload it around the same time frame. So it should be like one of the videos uploaded during the same time frame. Unbelievable stuff from, from Matt Lane, a.k.a. Bowler. Unbelievable stuff. Throwing out my government name. And don't sue me. I mean, why would you sue me? It doesn't make any sense. But nothing. I, there's a lot of things I do that make, don't make any sense. Anyways, peace out, y'all.